You give expression to our well-founded hope in the excellence of each student and the excellence that you celebrate in all dimensions of your lives. To each of you, our award recipients, congratulations. It was such an honour to receive this award. It's such an achievement and I, I realised that and I can't believe that I've stood next to recipients just like me that have worked very hard and have succeeded in their endeavours. Hannah Galeb is an exemplary role model in the way she has made an outstanding contribution to the college. She is truly a worthy recipient of this award for student excellence. I'm so proud to be able to present my faith within a wider community and I'm very happy with myself. I'm very happy with my school community and my principal for being able to trust in me to present my faith. As our mission prefect, Emilian has been an exemplary witness of our faith through his leadership in the faith life of our college. He's the big commandment for his commitment to helping those in need through his leadership in college fundraisers and social justice initiatives. Oh, I'm super honoured and super excited to have been a part of this and to get to wear John the 23rd's name on my chest with pride. Oh look, this is a very proud dad moment. Very proud of Ethan and his achievements. Ethan demonstrates unwavering dedication and commitment to serving others through his advocacy for vocational education in his involvement in the formation of St John the 23rd. It's been very exciting coming here and being able to get the award with everyone. We are so proud of Charlie Rose and everything she's achieved and so blessed. Her generosity of spirit is a marker of what makes her most worthy of this recognition. This is echoed in her tireless work for social justice initiatives, and we are immensely proud of her. Oh, honoured, absolutely honoured. It feels good working with the Catholic school so long, being Catholic in my primary school and high school, and especially with all my peers alongside me. It's actually really good um, getting accredited for everything we've done. The patrician charism calls us to see Christ in all people. In his student leadership role as college captain, Isaac Paulino approaches all situations with humility, compassion and care. What I loved about tonight is that we got to see the students from right across our entire diocese being recognised for their hard work and achievement and it's not just on one test. This is a culmination of six years of hard work in high school and seven years of work that these students have put in to being who they are today. My HSC tip is Study hard, but rest harder. If you're burned out, you won't get anything done, and keep that for the rest of your life. Definitely palm cards, especially if you like public speaking or debating. Writing out in like a sentence or a speech structure and then just repeating that over and over again until you remember it is really, really helpful. Try and stick with what you love. Keep with your hobbies and don't let go of what has made you you. Enjoy it while you can because time will fly. Be prepared, do everything earlier rather than leave it to the last minute. Stress is a killer, so do not leave it to the very night before the exam. <laughs> you know, there's lots of things going around that you might think you need to do, but you need to find what works best for you. To the class of 2023, congratulations. This is what you have worked for your entire school life. Enjoy it, celebrate, your hard work has paid off. My message to everyone in my cohort is we're so close to being finished. I just want to wish everyone the best of luck this year. We've come through such a tough time over our years with COVID and I know that you're going to do great things on the journey ahead. All we need is to keep faith at the centre of our lives, remain calm as we fast approach the end of our journey.